So you YouTube is where you can say something on back before we get to it. Make sure you like and subscribe as you always. Watch for a video. Kaisenet was upset because during a charity soccer game, someone was holding up a sign that says, we're friends though, which is now a famous <laughs> line said by singer Tyler when Kaisenet asked her out on the stream. Here's what Kaisenet did when he saw the sign. <laughs> I, I still feel like, like it, as far as that stuff that goes right there, I still feel like, God, you should have, you should have, like, before you shoot your shot, you gotta, like, you gotta somewhat know that you have a chance to score. Like you shot your shot at, at somebody that you've been treating or that you no know, y'all been having friend moments. You you have probably never flirted with her. You have probably never said nothing, nothing like nothing in a flirtatious way to her. So therefore, like you can't just have no no moments of uh, flirtation. She ain't flirting with you. You ain't flirting with her. And then hey, you want to go on a date? I mean, sometimes it works, but sometimes like in that moment, especially with who y'all are, nah. Not, not in that moment. If you, you probably did that off camera, talked about it, it probably wasn't friends on you. And also during the charity soccer game between AMP and Beta Squad, fans decided to run out onto the field when the score was six to six because they wanted to take pictures and hug them. But they ended up having to run into the back quickly because there was so many people That's coming onto like the field ants. at once. It was just crazy. Kai said that ended up going live, which I'm gonna show y'all that in a minute, but no one got hurt. Money was still raised for charity and it might possibly be a rematch that happens soon in the future. So stay tuned for that. Bro, Todd Game? Really? Todd Game. Top Game. Todd Game. How you feeling? You love? Yeah. Bro, you didn't tell me you were going. Nah. Man. Hey, look, bro. Y'all ruined it, bro. Ruined it. Look, bro. I missed three times. If y'all would never. That fourth one was really coming. And if y'all would have never ran on this shit, I would have scored. I would have You would have scored three. I would have scored. You would have scored three. I would have scored three. And I would have scored. Six four after that. I probably would have got one. Team's nigga, lying. I got one. How much you would have scored, Chris? Uh, oh. Uh, one. Fuck. <laughs> Sharky. Yo. I scored on you guys, bro. Say, say, fucking hell. I fucking hell, you fucking one. You, I scored on you guys. Feet. I scored on you guys. Easy free kick. Fucking hell, eh? Right, you missed the penalty. Dub, who recently just Dug, broke up bro. with the mother of his child, Brittany, and he moved out, is asking for her to take him back. Hold on, just don't turn around yet. Moved out. They still live in the same house. <laughs> what? 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 What are you talking about? They still live in the same house. What are you talking about? They is not. They be saying nothing changed. He moved out is asking for her to take him back. Hold on, just don't turn around yet. Fuck no. What is you backpacking for? Shut up. Who are you? You got all this gold. If it was green, would you say yes? No. Never. It's never happened. What? We're not going to be a trio. We're not going to be in traffic in LA. None of Nah, I mean, we could be friends. We've been being cool, being co parents, but confidential. Can't, can't, nah, can't do that relationship again. What's so wrong with you? Honestly, I wouldn't take this. Get up, you just you gotta, get up, go, go, get up. That's me, though. You can't clean the stuff. So, no. Corey allegedly just found out that another girl had his baby recently. I think for Dell, like, if, if he was like being serious, I, I react to that video and I think it was, it was all jokes. But if you was like really, really serious, you for sure gotta like, you gotta come hard. Pause. Pause. You gotta, <laughs> you gotta step harder for her. That sounds my better. You gotta step harder for her. 
pause. Still. <laughs> and for sure, be way more affectionate, bro. Like you don't you're not dating uh uh a girl who's on who's on you know on some tomboy stuff. You're not dating uh uh a hood chick. And even them, some of them will cry babies. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Some of these hood chicks, they be crybabies, right? Like they be shade crybabies. But no, she's not on some on some tough stuff, bro. Like you gotta be affectionate, bro. Like and both y'all have said that in, in multiple videos that you're not affectionate. And you got a girly girl, bro. You gotta be affectionate. Hey, congratulations. Also, Corey just spent his birthday with his new boo. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna post my I'm gonna post my baby on him. This nigga boy. So all of a sudden, you've been trying to get your girl back or your wife back. You've been trying to get your wife back. Everything was all good. The uh, the breakup was fake. You was you was doing good. You wasn't cheating, but you got a newborn. Can you call my baby. Yeah, get another kid. Yeah, look. I saw that, but I was like, that's okay. Yeah. No, that ain't like how you say yeah. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it's like, like when you say yeah, like, for sure, like, for sure. Like, for sure. Y'all. He said for sure. Congrats, bro. Thank you. Right. Corey, wasn't he just requirement? Man, I've been single. Man, listen, I've been, I've been single since October, October last year. Yeah. I'm trying to fix things. I, and I tried to go back and fix it. I tried to be a man. And she dipped out on me. Let me talk to you. But the root. But it was fake. It was fake. She was with you on the side, on the side of you the whole time. And you was making your post. This nigga boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. This is this is crazy. I'm cool. He did attempt to fix his family and do things the right way as a man should at the end of the day because he's committed to this. But sometimes people outgrow each other. They say you like 60 60 Somebody said they're here soon, though. You do kind of like. No. Not really, but like just off the side. Off the side. No. No. No, bro. I'm not judging you. That's not the one I'm picking. CJ So Cool dropped the video called Do I Love My Kids? And a lot of people were shocked to see Lexi in the video not only because last month she said that she was done with him but the fact that she had so many problems with his kids people felt like she wasn't really supposed to be in a video like this of him speaking about his kids but here's yeah. what CJ had to say I don't know if you recall this but I used to kind of be me I used to kind of be mean to the kids a lot um not my kids the other kids. actually Kamari too Kamari was a part of it when I used to have all those kids in the videos it was almost like I was Joe Jackson sometimes. I had to be strict, right? And Lexi just bought my camera. Um, no, I, didn't uh, I had to be strict, right? And I didn't want to be strict because that's not really who I am. I'm the fun person, the good guy. I'm the guy that's going to buy you what you want, take you where you want to go. And a lot of people don't like me for that. CJ, you don't know how to be a parent. You just buy them what they want. You suck. I understand that too. But I mean, when I wasn't doing that, when I was trying to be... Because material things don't make you a good parent. A lot of people need, need to understand that. Buying things does not make you a good parent. We've all been kids before, right? So we all had a moment where we just want to be up under our parents. That's it. Forget buying me anything. We can sit here and starve for two days. Let's just watch a movie. What are you talking about, bro? Jackson, everybody was hating me anyway. And every time I made a slip up, it ended up on the internet. So, I mean, it always just, it's never enough. So I understand that everybody just don't think different and see everything differently. I, I get it. Yeah, them, she, that CJ and the other CJ, they, they should be best friends, bro, because them niggas is weird. 